What's up YouTube, James here again, and this time I'm going to show you guys this new software I got called Copy Trans Control Center. Anyways, there's a download link in the description, just click that download link or paste it into your URL and it'll bring you up to this page. Now if you have, I think this is for Windows, yeah this is for Windows, so anyways, if you have Windows just re-download, click that. And that should start automatically, and if it doesn't, click there. You guys already have it saved, see? It doesn't take that long to download. Well, actually, I gotta make sure this is the right thing. I'll run you through the install. Okay, so run. Now I'm gonna uh, repeat important things twice, because there's a little bit of an audio lag. Okay, and it should bring you up with this. You're gonna want this. See? Manage your iPod and iPhone without iTunes. This is what you want, so click that. The first time you do it, it's going to take you a little while. It's going to try to download it, and so here it'll be like download program. And the first time, I didn't think it was going to work, but it just took a while. So just remember that. Don't give up on it. Anyways, I'm pretty sure you can just exit out of this. Just don't show this again. Exit out. And now you can safely connect your iPod. Oh, did I just click a board? Alright. Anyways. There it is. Here's my iPod. So, I got all this stuff on here. You can go to music. Got all your music on your iPod. You can simply right click it, play. You can delete it from iPod. You can change the artwork. Copy transversion. No, I do not want to download the latest one. You will get the latest one on that download link, just so you know. Anyways. So you can delete it and do all this cool stuff. To add stuff, you want to go to Add, Tracks to Playlist. Or maybe not, hold on. Pretty sure. Yeah, okay. So let's see. I have all these songs added, but you can just play. Anyways, this one by Eminem. I think I have this one, actually. Just press OK. And it adds in there. And the cool thing about this is you add in everything you want. I gotta remove this because I already have it. So you add everything you want, and after you're done, you just put update. Then it says sync in progress on your iPod. It's really cool. And there, I already got it. See? And then you can do the same thing with videos. You can open them up. You can do podcasts. And that's pretty much the whole thing. It's a really it's soft, especially if you don't like unnecessary iTunes stuff. And if you want to get stuff off it easier, instead of it downloading everything to your iPod, taking all the apps and stuff, and also Copy Trans has all these other things. Which I'm not sure what they are, but you guys can check them out if you want. comes with this install package. Anyway, see you guys next time. And what did I do next time for a video? I remember I was going to do something. I don't know. I guess, No? I remember now. It's going to be SSH in your iPod. It's going to be a two to three part video all about how to open up your iPod, get apps and stuff. Um, it pretty much opens up your iPod in files, but more like um, sort of specific files, like an app file and all that stuff. Anyways, show you that next video and probably the next couple videos. So I'll see you guys later. Peace. You know what? No, not peace. No, just, just bye. Just bye.